I'm Jane Melby and I'm riding SM Gold Plated Mercedes. Three key basics to a barrel racing lesson with myself would be changing your seat, getting your body round, and helping you to use your horn to pull yourself up or down. I think it is so important that you have your feet underneath you so you can move your body where you want it to go. I don't want my body to come forward and fall. My chin stays even with my saddle horn. It doesn't go ahead of it. I don't want it behind it. I want it even. I also feel that it's important that you have your reins short enough that your rein isn't up here in your chest. If your rein is in your chest, it's too long. It's hard to ride in a go position if your reins are too long because they hit you. If I wake my horse up a little bit so he picks his head up, see where my reins are? I want my hands in a box area around my saddle horn area. I don't want my hands up high, I don't want them low. When I turn a barrel, I ride where my hand stays at my saddle horn area. So if I was approaching the second barrel, I ride in a straight line three feet away, my hand goes to my horn, and my rein hand stays roughly at the saddle horn area. I also ride with my knuckles up. By riding with my knuckles up, it allows my elbows to be away from my side. It allows my rib cage to be open so my horse doesn't brace through a turn. For more tips from the Blue Bonnet Ambassadors, visit bluebonnetfeeds.com.